Have you ever looked at your keyboard and wondered, why on earth aren't the keys arranged in simple ABC order? I mean, wouldn't that make typing easier? Believe it or not, the reason goes back more than 150 years, and it has everything to do with a problem most people today don't even know existed. When the first typewriters were invented in the 1800s, their keys were actually arranged alphabetically. But there was a huge problem. People typed too fast, and the metal arms inside the typewriter kept crashing into each other and getting jammed. To fix this, engineers intentionally slowed typists down by rearranging letters so that commonly paired letters were spaced apart. This layout eventually became the QWERTY keyboard we still use today. But QWERTY wasn't just random. It was carefully engineered to reduce mechanical jams by separating frequently used keys, balancing hand movement, and making typing smoother on typewriters. Fast forward to modern computers, the mechanical problem is gone, but QWERTY stayed because billions of people already learned it. Changing the layout today would break muscle memory, slow productivity, and require companies to redesign interfaces, shortcuts, and training systems worldwide. Even though faster layouts like DORAC or COMAC exist, almost no one adopts them because QWERTY is too deeply embedded into daily life. So the next time you type hello or keyboard, remember, the layout under your fingers isn't alphabetical because it was engineered to solve a 19th century problem, and it stuck simply because the world never looked back.